even when I witness acts of incredible unkindness. Rubbish. You really are a moron, aren't you? Oh. Why are people so unkind? Come on, ladies and gentlemen. Come on. Footsteps falling down a hollow in the middle of the night. I start hearing little sounds become so good evening. Why? I've just spent six months in the recording studio. And I'm very proud to announce tonight the release of my new record, Whispering Kamal. Why? Just a touch, a touch of curry and rice. Why? Take the pressure cooker down. Take all my knobs and turn them around. Turn the cooker down. Why don't you think out of ten for the... Well, Rather it was different. the most uh, original performance I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> There's a law against this sort of thing. A simple question I've been asking for the last nearly 30 years. Why are people so unkind? They're all down from Sydney, these boys, and uh, simply called the Jackson Jive. Amazing grace, how sweet. Like me. I once was lost, but now am found. Was blind, but now I see. Twas grace that taught. I've been asking for the last nearly 30 years. Why are people so unkind? Why they do this to me? So a, lot of, a lot of people may have thought that that was in terribly bad taste. Well, it was. Yeah. And, you're a real and, white man, Kamal. You know that. <laughs> I, I knew uh, you were up to something. Uh, yes, well, I, knew, I knew you didn't. You, you got the wrong name. You were a good sport. You're uh, off to, uh, you should be called white something or other. Yeah. You're uh, <laughs> 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 uh, Harry, uh, a little better than the last act, perhaps. Man, you know, if you take the Jackson 5 and subtract this 5... <laughs> whoa! Man, if they turned up looking like that in the United States... Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah zero. Like, hey, hey, there's no more show. Why are people so unkind? Hello? Uh, g'day, Daryl. It's lighting here. Is Kamal coming up uh, next to you? Yes, he is. Well, could you ask him to smile so we can see him, all right? Thank you. Thanks, Rick. Lovely to have you on. Thank you, Chris. Mr. Kamal, I'm mm -hmm. a great fan of yours, and I predict that album will go black. It's a, it's a bit of a gamble. So is that shirt, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> You're off to uh, Carnegie Hall. Um, uh, direct from uh, Hey Hey Saturday. Yeah. Carnegie, Carnegie Hall. Carnegie Hall. Are you doing it doing in my face, are you? <laughs> I know one time on before, I put the wig on my black nut and all that, okay. and we tried you on the chair, but nothing like this. This time is a legit Christmas thing for all the mums. Why are people so unkind? I think we may have offended you with that. Thanks, Daryl, and I just wanted to say on behalf of, you know, of my country, um, I know it was done in, in, in humorous, yeah. but, you know, we've spent so much time trying to not make black people look like buffoons. <laughs> all right, Reverend, I feel I have to speak my mind. Oh, Reverend Fatback and I want you all to know that our church doors are open to you 24 hours a day. Oh, yes, sir. We're using a Harry Connick Jr. CD. Oh, Reverend, I just happen to have one of those right here. Oh. Hey, hey, there's no more show. <laughs> Why they do this to me? And if I knew that was going to be a part of the show, I probably, I definitely wouldn't have done it. Am I Kamal? <laughs> 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 
I would say a little yes. more active. Yes. I think I think yes. your husband would be upset if he found <laughs> Kamala was on your head. Why?